There is rain in the area, but we've been given the go-ahead to get this one started. Tonight, it's game three of this four-game set between the Oakland A's and the Boston Red Sox. It's baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. Let's play ball. Three. Yeah. So coming to the plate, number two. two. And the Red Sox the with an opportunity for more number damage two. here in the first. From the belt, kicks and deals. Line toward right center. And he'll get over to... Come on, get it, get it, get it, How did he do that? Cool is on his way home. He comes across to score as it's now a 2-0 ball game. Well, that's the difference between a harmless error and a costly one. With the bases empty, it doesn't hurt that much, but with a man on, that allows a run to score. So now it'll be the four-hole hitter, Juan Soto. And he's got that Go batting lineup near the 300 oh. mark entering play. Ready now with the payoff pitch. And he's able to lay off there for ball four. And that'll put runners at the corners now with still nobody out. I'll tell you, he's looked unsteady out there since the first pitch he threw. A couple of hits and a free pass, so he's really searching for an answer to get back on track. We'll see if he can settle down here. Into the box, Craig Heinrich. And they're runners at the corners now. Heinrich. The three and one pitch. This one's flared off to the right side. Mobley has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. And he might have thought about it at third, but with one away, decides not to risk it. With that, here's how the hometown Red Sox line up in this one. Who's the one to watch, Dan? Well, I think the focus has to be on the man hitting third. I'm so impressed with him right now. He's leading the American League in home runs right now. With all the, the great hitters in the AL, that's really saying something. You don't want to miss any of this guy's ABs. Standing in, Eddie Batting Chavez. Six. And there's a the look at his baseman. home and road splits Eddie so far this year. Chavez. Still only one out in the inning. And a fastball blew it right by him, and there are two down. Wow, that's awfully impressive right there. The pitch before was really close. Called the ball. What does he do? He comes back with a better pitch and gets the punch out. Standing in, Nate Acho. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Nate Acho. Ready on one and two. Scorched to third. Throw to first in time, and the big inning is avoided as the side is retired. So two runs on two hits, one error in the inning, and a couple of men left. On to the second inning now from Fenway Park. Boston's out in front, two to nothing. Start of the second here in Boston. Let's check in with Heidi for a bit more on the weather. Matt, light rain is in the forecast throughout most, if not all, of the game. But I've been told it's not expected to cause any delays. The grounds crew will just need to make an effort to keep the field as dry as possible between innings, especially the heavy traffic areas like the pitching mound and around the bases. Now at the plate, number now two. Batting. 0 for 1 here number in the two. early going. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. A ball and no strikes. Swing and a miss as he ramps up on the fastball. One and one. He came out of his shoes on that one, boys. I know he swung and missed it. We felt the breeze from up here, but if he gets that pitch again and catches it a grain low, we got action. The count now at two and one. Bases are empty, one man out. Ball 
line drive to center field. And here's a dive by the center fielder, but it's off his glove. And he is in at second base with a one-out double. And the streak is alive. As you can see on the graphic, he creeps ever closer to the big number 56. Amazing what this guy has been able to do. Think about the pressure every day he gets to the ballpark. Members of the media asking about the streak and keep it going. Is he looking forward down the line? Now Amazing that, how he's no been able to concentrate through all of this. Oh. Yeah, and how it affects everyone else oh, around no. him because everyone's pushing for him to get a knock every night. You can't lose sight of trying to win ball games, but man, the focus of our attention is squarely on this player. Weinstein will range to his left and put it away. Two down. Digging in to try it again. Craig Heinrich, runner in scoring the position with two gone. Craig Heinrich. Runner breaks for third. Now a swing and a little bouncer softly hit to the right side of the mound. Throw on to first gets him and the side is retired. Some of our nation's young minds and future leaders here in attendance. Yikes. The three of us return with more Wednesday night baseball after this. Striding in, number two, one for two number with a double two. on the ledger so far. First offering on its way. Popped him up. Wow. Moving to his left. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. So they're held in check here this half of the inning. Five innings complete. The Red Sox are out in front, two to nothing. Stepping in, now number back. two. Two outs number and two, two runners aboard here in the seventh inning. Looking to keep this a one run game, the pitch. According to the career numbers on the back of his baseball card, number two is, get this, slugging over 700. That's a number almost unheard of, so if you can help it, don't miss any of his at bats. Fouled off. Two. Here it is. Another one sent foul. Keep battling, young man. Three foul balls in a row. He is calibrating that heater and the off speed. Let's see if he can catch something on the barrel. Here's the Owen two. Lost it in the score, air out toward hard. right center. Weinstein giving chase. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. So it's no runs on two hits, no errors, and two men left stranded. Eighth inning coming up. The Red Sox on top, two to one. And these home fans are getting a little spoiled as they take the first three of this four-game homestand. They might want to break out the brooms for the next one as they look to finish off with a big sweep. Close one tonight, 2-1 to one the final score. Boston jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Jason Rosenberg claims the win out of the pen his first as he tosses five no-hit innings. Sal Lair is settled with a loss after giving up only one earned. Ray Iavino closes the door for the save, his 15th of the campaign. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasquez, and you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com.